Hi, I'm Ian Quick with the Toy and Game Expo. We are currently at Miss Tiggy Winkles, and we're going to find out just what are the hottest toys and games this year. Toys! Games! I'd like you to meet my new friend, Christina, who manages the Miss Tiggy Winkles here. Hello. Now, Christina, what have been the hottest toys or games so far this year? Well, the first one is the Ogo Sport, which is an awesome game. It's basically ping pong with two discs that have a little trampoline in the middle, and you're passing a koosh ball from side to side. It's an amazing toy. It's like a little mini trampoline for koosh balls. Can you make it do flips? If you get really good at it, yeah. <laughs> Sounds fun. Anything else? One of the best games this year has been Dixit. It's a great game for using your imagination. You just find a card with a picture on it. You have to use like one word or phrase to describe that card, and then everyone else has to follow suit. Oh, interesting. Now, those have been the hottest games so far. I'd like to know, what do you think will be the hottest toys or games this coming holiday season? These two are some of my favorites, and everyone seems to agree because they sell like crazy. They are basically little toys. It's almost like a really dense silly putty. So this one you build a little snowman, this one you build a witch, and after a little while, they actually start to melt. <laughs> oh, what a world. <laughs> Anything else? Rainbow Loom is an awesome toy. It's really, really awesome in that it's simple for younger kids to learn. I um, mean, you have to basically weave a bracelet using elastics. Wow. Old school quilting meets new world rubber technology with rubber bands. Yep. Love it. Okay, one last thing. Everybody has a favorite toy or game here. Mm -hmm. I want to know, what are the staff picks? Well, myself and some of the rest of us included love Escape. It is a great game. It is cooperative, which is awesome because you're trying to beat the board as opposed to playing against all the other players. And you're getting in a temple and out of the temple in under 10 minutes because it is timed. It comes with a soundtrack. And if one, even one person is left in the temple, then the whole team loses. It's basically like Indiana Jones, but in a game. Sounds quite epic. Well, thank you very much for joining us here, Christina. Hope to see you again soon. I'm Christina from Mrs. Tiki Winkles, proud supporter of Toy and Game Expo. For more details, visit the website, toygameexpo.com. See you there. Nuts. Oh.